heck is going up guys here is Xlantech with another tutorial for you and today I'm going to teach you how you can fix this DLL file error which you can see right now which will appear right inside of your Windows uh, folder and then inside of your system32 folder so basically if you want to copy a DLL file like this one here if you want to drag it inside no it won't work try again you need permission to perform this action and actually we are going to try to fix this error basically what do you need to do is follow my steps and everything everything will work how it should work and I'm going to try to explain it as much as possible I will show you actually two methods how to do that so let's begin with the first one with the easier one with the harder one and then with the easier one go to Windows after that go to system32 or system valve 64 for me that will be system32 and then right click on system32 click on properties go to security after that go to advanced owner change the owner and change it to your username of your PC if you don't know which is your username of your PC basically that's this name you can see right here now this is for Windows but it might be look but it might look different to you if you are using a Mac or I don't know maybe other systems after you type your PC name username then click OK after that go to apply okay guys everything is done go to ok and press ok once again and we are not finished yet right click properties again go to advanced once again go to security after that go to advanced clip enable inheritance and click and click apply once again you're about to change the permission settings on your system folders click OK click continue or cancel it and I think that this should work really fine let's test it out hopefully it will work I will replace it with the same DLL file that I copied earlier replace the file destination and guys it's working perfectly just follow me and everything will be all right if you didn't catch up with me just pause the video in the section where you where you are thinking that you didn't caught up with me after that I am going to show you now the second method is basically pretty much as the same but it's really easier and what do you need to do first once you need to download uh, the file that will be in the description of course after you download it install it install take ownership click on yes after that click OK I will turn my volume down Click install take ownership after you did that you will get an option which will uh, enable you to get permission of all your folders and files you have basically I don't have system of 64 permission to do anything right now here I will try to delete this file is it working no and it should work because these files are are recommended for your PC and if you delete it you will might mess something up with your PC and it won't start correctly right click on the folder which you want to take ownership and click take ownership it's really easy as that and now the bad part of this you have to wait about one minute or two and I think that I will skip this part only I will show you to you how it looks like
Oh my god, it actually get faster as I thought than I thought. And let's try to delay this file once again. But I'm going first. I'm going first to make a copy on the desktop. Address parser. Continue. Deleted. Easy as that. And I will return it back because it could mess with my PC, like it did the last time. And then had and then I had to re redone this tutorial. And basically guys that's it, if you like this tutorial please leave a like, share and subscribe and I see you guys the next time.